There's something interesting in this one. So it's Bohemian Pilsner, 15 grams rewok, 5 grams citra. The rewok. Mm. We don't know. I love that. That rewok hops my favourite. Yeah. You know, like I'm a chef and I love flavour and I love what flavours do with each other, you know. Is hops a herb? Yes. I yeah, believe so. so. Tell me about Williams Warren. Is that opening up some of those uh, herby uh, experimentation? What Williams Warren is enabling me to do as a amateur brewer controls the variables that I may not be able to control so much. It's great that they've done the work on that and it gives me a chance to play with the hopping. Just really dialing in and really trying to, trying to find those flavours that I'm looking for. So Williams Warren has given us a whole new play paint with a brew cake system. Yeah. How, how do you make the call between brew cake, brewmaster, or just really going traditional and doing the whole mashing and boiling and, and everything? To me, the whole mashing and boiling wasn't an option for me. I don't have the time to do that. And I didn't want to make 50 litres at once or 30 litres at once of one kind of beer. I wanted to be able to plate my beers off against each other and quantify results immediately. That left me with this as an option and you know, and the price was is very sharp on this. It takes longer to clean the keg to sterilise it than it does to put a brew down. And you can have two taps on at once. On this tap I had a Dutch Pilsner and then on that I had the Bohemian Pilsner both with exactly the same hopping process. I've had it four months and it's probably paid for itself by now. Are you a purist when it comes to your beer? And I'm asking that because with Williams Warren we've seen people do some really interesting things. Vanilla yeah. and chocolate nerves, jelly. Yeah. I've played around with a few very simple infusions and to be actually be able to produce Something that is, in essence, your own, that you've made, that you've flavoured yourself. You know, I have friends come around and we talk about the flavours of it. We talk about how it could be better next time. What's next? Are you going to upgrade? Are you going to be bigger? So uh, restaurants, world domination, uh, where, where's uh, this going to take you? If I was to upgrade, I would buy another one of these. I'd buy exactly the same. Um, I am starting to slightly think about the 25 litre kegs because you can go through 10 litres quite quickly. So you know, I think if I was to upgrade, I'd buy another one of those, I'd put a 25 in each. That's, that's all I'd do. Um, I think I've got the perfect system for me.